this is a new video series where I will be talking about stacking abilities to increase the effects of some abilities that work together and to reduce the negative effects of some other abilities. So first out are our favorite shock infantry unit, the Berserkers. They have a very nice melee attack to begin with. They have the 15 bonus against infantry, which also applies to their melee attack and their weapon damage. They have a beastly charge bonus of 51, but there are of course ways to increase this further, and two of the ways are the Berserker's already existing abilities, Frenzy and Headhunt, that can, when activated before a charge, both increase weapon damage substantially, increase melee attack, and also increase the charge bonus. However, we can increase this even further if we use the general's abilities from Ariovistus, the fast charge and the pride. And if these four abilities are used together, the results can be extremely devastating. Now, there is a fifth ability to consider here, and that is the ability of the Berserkers to run amok. Because if the Berserkers run amok, it's going to cancel out the negative effects of the Frenzy and of the Headhunt. So that means that you'll be able to use all of these four abilities with zero downside to the Berserkers. And the great thing is that two of these abilities, the Fast Charge and the Pride, can be used by several units at once because it's, a, it's an area of effect type of skill. So the Ariovistus, if, if timed, is very, very effective. So now we have the, the Charge Bonus increase here of 52. So it's, it's going to be 71 now, the charge bonus. And we're going to activate Headhunt and Frenzy. And then Headhunt. And when these guys make contact now, they're going to have... Let's just have a look at their... Uh, they're going to have a charge bonus of 91. Their melee attack is 66. Their weapon damage is... is um, 26, but it's going to increase due to them having uh, Headhunt and uh, Frenzy on. So with these three abilities, we're getting a 91 charge bonus, which means that the Berserkers are going to be doing 102 damage initially on the charge. Um, the cool thing about this ability stack is that as the effects of Fast Charge and Frenzy die down, the effects of Headhunt are going to increase over time. So they're going to get increases in melee attack as the uh, increases from melee attack due to the charge bonus that lasts 30 seconds is going to decrease here. And doing it this way is going to allow these guys to do massive amounts of damage on the charge. Now I'm activating pride as well. So that's going to increase their weapon damage of course. And that means that the the Berserkers are going to do more armor penetration damage, they're going to do more total damage, and the Oathsorn don't stand a chance when up against this stack of abilities. So we have Fast Charge, Frenzy, we have Headhunt, we have Pride, and now the Berserkers run amok. So that means that when their, uh, when their Frenzy and their Headhunt abilities run out, they won't get the penalties those abilities would confer to other units because they have uh, because they have the impetuous traits and they can run amok. So while there are only 37 berserkers left in this unit, they are going to defeat almost twice as many Oathsorn because of their uh, because they are amok or they are out of control. They are berserk, I should say. And the pride ability is still on, so they still have the increase in armor penetration damage while they are going berserk. And now the all the abilities uh, all the abilities died out, but after all the abilities died out, they killed 76, 76 Oathsorn. And the Oathsorn don't have a chance to recover from this, it's just too heavy of a blow to sustain. The Oathsorn are wavering, they're losing, they are up against the fair causing unit, and the Berserkers win with 30 men remaining. So one of the biggest effect stacks you can possibly get will be the Berserkers with Fast Charge, with Pride, with Frenzy, with Headhunt, and then the 
and then the berserkers going berserk afterwards that is a very very good stack of abilities if timed right this can just wreck entire armies in seconds thanks for watching i'll see you again on the battlefield